I'm Dr. Lindsay Doe, clinical sexologist and host of this Sex Curious Show, Sexplanations. Today's episode is sponsored by adamandeve.com, where you can get all sorts of playthings for your crotch. <clears throat> Here's the situation. I have been having a hard time with my brain and figuring out how to write and think and talk. So to keep it simple and to just have contact with you, which would be nice, I got this big box shipped to me here in the US where I am for the summer and I'm gonna open it up just like I would receiving it for the first time and go through some of the goodies. Remember that one time Dr. Doe sliced herself making an episode about sex toys? Yeah, I remember that. Super bloody for additional information and has the contact phone number for the Adam and Eve company. It doesn't say Adam and Eve anywhere on the product, so you are getting all your penetrative and sleeve-like luby objects discreetly, but it does say that there are some big batteries in here that need to be claimed for the postal care. Packaging, I'm gonna get this which is a limited time offer of free DVDs. All the porno one could need between shipments and then so many toys. Purple is the theme today. I'm gonna take them all out, move the box, and then we'll go through them individually. Yeah? Yeah. Time lapse. Holy mackerel. Okay, oh my gosh, this is exciting. A lot of my life is paid for by those of you at Patreon and our sponsors, YouTube, Advertisements may exist, but we're making barely anything. Like, please, if a video puts up an ad, just click away from it. Don't, it's not worth your time to watch. It does not make us anything. If you're on YouTube Red, okay, that's great. There's some there, but it, we're talking like minuscule, tiny little amounts of money. 0. 0.00000001 cent for your eyeballs. A lot of my lifestyle is paid for by telling you about these products, which Makes me feel a lot of different things, but what I have resolved is that it affords me the ability to do something really cool, which is to get sex education out there to the public. So thank you all for all the many ways that you may support this channel by just engaging with it or supporting us on Patreon or by buying yourself nice things and reinforcing our sponsors to take care of us. As they do. This is amazing. Okay. So here we go, all sorts of goodies. I'm gonna start with this one because it has something interactive on it, a garter. A lot of these I will do individual reviews of as we go through the regular Adam and Eve videos where I talk about a subject that is important to me and, and then I include a toy in it. But we'll just do a couple of them here so you can see just like what cool things I get. And I don't choose these, at least not this batch. Sometimes I'll be like, hey, can you send me this or this? But in this case, I just asked them to send me some cool things and they did. This is Barely Bare Lace Mini Robe. If you have an idea of how I can incorporate this in an episode, let me know. I have been thinking about, there are the, there's this store where you can buy enormous canvases for super cheap. And I've been thinking about removing all the staples and then doing a body painting of them. And maybe I'll put this on afterward like modesty, it, late, I don't know. I don't understand sexuality anymore. Things aren't, aren't making sense to me. Breathless, air pulse, stimulation, and vibration. This one, oh, it's got a pretty seal, so I wanna leave it on for right now. But instead of having a protruding suction cup, this one is just built in. And it says on the back, whisper quiet, body safe silicone, easy to clean, waterproof. That's nice, and it's really light. Looks like Satisfier and Adam and Eve got into a marriage some sort of relationship. It's definitely polyamorous. Look at all of these toys. Okay, what else do we have here? 10 times Versa Thrust. Whole bunch of different attachments to this very classic vibrator. You have a penetrative object here and then a clitoral stimulator here. And then this shaft or handle here holds so that you can manipulate the buttons to make it go faster or spin or bounce or thrust or these toys you could do a whole episode you could i could do a whole episode about the evolution of rabbit pearl vibes there are so many things i want to do will i do them i don't know oh what are you are you oh you are a bunny you say you're a bunny this is eve's hands-free shower button bunny so it goes suction cup wise probably onto a shower and then you can leg up if i were holding these toys you just leg and then mm, the shower it also looks like it's made out of jelly rubber so put condoms on your toys if you can same with this 
This looks jelly rubber. What are you? Are you gonna tell me what you're made out of? Made out of pure pleasure. Just kidding, that's not what it says. It's this firm, lifelike feel. Where is your ingredient? Do you not have to say on sex toys? I guess not. Anyway, this is something you definitely want to put a condom on, but it's super pretty and probably really affordable. So if you don't mind having a slightly questionable material in your household or your life, you can really get it on with this one. It's a little bit bigger than average. I think it's beautiful. I wonder if you could schlack it in silicone and then like put it in a fish tank or something. It would look really nice. My orifices are titillated. Let's put that down now. Okay. What are you? Eve Silky Sensations Rechargeable Bullet. So something simple, easy to throw in a bag. If you're going camping, you wanna just do it in the tent. A whole bunch of strokers, specifically for the shower. Look at all of those different openings. Anus, mouth, and vulva. Stay and latex free. I wonder if I can touch these. One of my future friends is going to get to penetrate this and they're, they're hopefully not gonna care that the bag is open. They're gonna know that the reason why they get to play with these fun toys is because I talked about them on a video. Oh my gosh, it's so soft. It's a little mouth. Take you out. <sighs> so soft. I don't know what material you're made out of. Proceed with your own risk. I have a really great video about sex toys, just a 101 run through that talks about materials and how to properly use them to take care of yourself. But yeah, so soft. Real deal, soft. Okay, look at that cute little mouth. And you can put it here in your hand, masturbate like this, turn around, masturbate like this, or they make holders that will actually grip it. Maybe there's some DIY YouTuber engineer who wants to create a device that allows people to hold their strokers, or you can stick them in between couch cushions, all sorts, get creative, stay curious. Look at this, back in the bag with you. All right, what else do we have? Eve's petite private pleasure wand. Oh, look, it's even hipster green. So cute, compact. It looks like a microphone. A powerful 10 function motor sends major vibration power right where you want it for body shaking orgasms. I wanna interview the people who write the backs of these, the descriptions. Mm -hmm. I would like to meet you if you're out there, let's hang out. Okay, what's next? Eve's twirling rabbit thruster. So Adam and Eve has sent me a lot of these. Not this one, a lot of these style vibrators and they'll do all sorts of motions. And I don't know that I've had a twirl before. I've had a twist and a thrust and a shake, but a twirl with a rabbit. No, don't fall down, stand proud or fall down. What is in this mystery box? I've never gotten a box like this before. Ooh, rot oscillator. So many things are happening on this package. First of all, the Science of Pleasure, brand new marketing. Like I've seen a lot of these, they're done by the same companies, but this is new. And look down here. It's Dr. Ruth Westheimer, who was the sex educator I listened to when I was young on sleepover, staying up late, listening to talk radio. She's quoted as saying, the eroticillator is the best device ever made for stimulation of the labia and clitoris. It offers women exciting, immensely satisfying orgasms with little or no effort. Ruth, I wanna try this and see if we agree. More packaging uniqueness. I feel like I'm opening a rocket here and not a sex toy. What is this? This looks like a wax candle. So many things are happening right now. This plastic seal is applied for sanitary reasons. That's nice. Okay, I'm not gonna open this yet in the future. Watch out, there is an eroticillator in my future. Two of these, they sent me a pussy and an ass. And these are Adam's personal trainers. More sleeves, very bald. I just, I wanna touch them. It says important message before using your personal trainer, remove the plastic packing tube inside the soft sleeve. I'm curious, I got it, gotta go in. We're gonna do the ass. Big flashlight effect here. Remove the cap or the lid. Now you're telling me there is something in the inside? Before using your personal trainer, what is it personally training you to do? Remove the plastic packaging tube inside the soft sleeve. This would be so painful. If you were to stick your penis or anything in, even my finger, it hurts. How do you get it out? You would be jamming your dickhead up against this tube. So I don't know about this one, but similar products you can put into warm water and it will make it so that it's much more flesh-like. 
And then we're going to re reinsert you into this rigid tube here and add some lube. Oh, that's much better. See, the thing about this is that unlike masturbating with your hand, this device creates a suction. So when you pull out, it's like the this ass is saying, no, don't go, keep doing me. That shit feels so good. Two fingers, sure, I'll give you two fingers. Prostate massage, okay. I love me a good sleeve. Close up shop, okay. Last thing, big thing, big huge thing, the Traveler Restraint and Bondage Play Kit. It's meant to look like a briefcase and it has a briefcase handle. Open up, sweet box. Show me what you got. No, show me. I feel like you all have to make room here for this exciting thing. Out of the way. Out of the way, my mess. Bow and submission to the bondage suitcase. All right. Oh, it's like a vinyl leather. It's not super fancy, but it just gives that feel and that sense of like, I'm serious. I will destroy you. I will own you. I will tell you what to do. I will make it hurt if you want me to. It's like a table. Oh my goodness, look at these nipple clamps. All right. We've got like the gray and white bedding. I feel as an expression of a sexual identity and then the rainbows. We're just gonna all out pride here right now. And I'm gonna add some BDSM to my aesthetic with some, oh no, with some gold feather nipple clamps. Get on there. Come on. I'm beautiful. Oh my gosh. We have everything. You the right size? I'm not gonna put you in my mouth. But yeah, any size head. It's pretty good. Somebody is gonna look mighty sexy in all of this. What a good day. Stay curious. Thank you to all of you for supporting Sexplanations and for supporting adamandeve.com, sharing a whole bunch of sex education with us by way of also giving us sex toys at 50% off. When you use the promo code DOE, my last name, D-O-E, at checkout, you can get 50% off an eligible item plus free shipping on your whole order to the US and Canada. Pretty freaking cool. Like you, you are amazing. Happy Pride. Edward multi-tool hands. Hmm.